Wyoming vacation part one. We are about to leave our garage. We're gonna be backpacking the Wind River Range. She thinks she's going with us. You're wasting all the footage. No, I'm not. Popping bottles. Bluffs. Bluffs. All right, now we're at a rest area, going up to a scenic overview. <laughs> yeah, we're going straight into the sun. This is a pretty nice view. Poppin' Bottles, part two. Ah! I just ordered a Big Mac at four, four in the morning. We forgot our fishing gear, so we're going to Cabela's to buy slingshots. <laughs> so I made this rabbit to practice our aim with our slingshots. We're shooting paper pellets at it. It's a wonderful work of art. Here comes Andrew shooting a slingshot at the... Oh, that was a beauty. Yeah. We just woke up and we're heading down to Lander, Wyoming where we're staying in a hotel for a night and then we're finally gonna head out to our hike in the Wind River Range tomorrow. So stay tuned. Follow me. Follow me. Driving through the Wind River Canyon in Wyoming. All right, guys, so we just arrived in Lander, Wyoming. Um, we just checked into the Pronghorn Lodge, moved all our stuff in there, and now we're exploring. Moo! No! Nah! <laughs> all right, we're uh, doing a little prep hike on the same trail that we're doing tomorrow, but we're probably only gonna go about 2.9 miles. But tomorrow we're you know, hike like 12 miles into the wilderness for a week, so that should be fun. This for 12 miles. You guys. Go, go. Come on, Fatal. All right, puppy. <laughs> Damn. I'm gonna record just in case I fall. Jesus, 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 Jesus. Oh, nope. 2.9 miles into our prep hike. This is where we're turning around and heading back to our car. Um, that's Sheep Bridge. All right, on our way back from Sheep Bridge. Oh, we are getting tired, ran out of water. Dude, right in the middle of the trail, are you serious? That's how he rolls. Shut! Alright, we're outside our hotel, about to go on the hike. We can get it. Oh, oh, dude, why are you covering my camera? Alright, let dude, go. Dude, what the? Alright, we are now starting our official hike. We're going off the grid for five days. Alright, we're practicing our bear spray just in case one of them runs up on us. Woo! It's got some recoil. <laughs> we have arrived at Sheep Ridge once again. Except we're actually going to cross the bridge this time, not turn around. Go deep into the mountains. Pump in water so we can drink. Here we see a sign that is confirming that we are about to enter the wilderness. Three miles into our hike, we are officially setting foot in the wilderness. Six miles into our hike, we've come up on Three Forks Park. We're gonna stop here and eat lunch. Just finished setting up our tent. Hey guys, welcome to this episode of Cribs, Tent Edition. Yep. <sighs> Gotta pump some water out of the stream for our delicious dinner of ramen noodles. Whoa.
All right, so about about 1.5 miles into our hike from our campsite, we have reached by far the most scenic part of our hike. I'm going to show you guys. Got a big lake with the mountain in the background. We spotted some cattle. They're scared of us, evidently, as they're all running away. Man, there are a lot of here. It's all right, we come in peace. Hey, hey, we're fine. Okay, the cattle are currently staring us down. We do not know what this means. Oh. Oh. Thanks, guys. Run on the trail. Thanks, guys. Look at the diarrhea. Oh. Caloria. I'm going this way. Ew. As we keep on going on our hike, this just keeps on getting more and more scenic and cool. But once we get up to the Deep Creek Lakes, there's an ice cave up there. There's a lot of scenic areas, and we're hopefully going to take a day hike up to the Continental Divide. And which is supposed to be a, an amazing view. All right, we've made it to Teo Park. We've caught a glimpse of some no, peak up there. Peak we've got to cross this river right here before we get to the Ice Lakes Trail. Okay, so we've gone quite a bit up and we thought we were done with our super steep climb, but I guess we have to go all the way up there to climb over that rock wall into our next campsite. So this should be fun. We are so tired. We have almost reached the sheer rock face. Looks a lot steeper in real life. Not sure if you guys can see how steep it is, but it's bad. Almost at the top of the sheer rock face that you were talking about. And this is a live Live reaction, we haven't seen what's on the other side. So, you guys will be experiencing it with us. All right, we've all decided that we're gonna camp here for the night. We didn't make it to the Ice Lakes or Deep Creek because we just did six miles of all uphill and we're all really tired. Well, we were righteous down there. Now we're up here because we realized that Brian's idea was stupid. Got a nice fire pit here. And this is my original spot. What? Whatever. But, yeah, we realized Brian's spot was bad. It's morning time again. We're packing up our camp and moving towards Deep Creek Lakes. Almost to Deep Creek. After, <clears throat> after miles of walking, we finally reached the Deep Creek Lakes. I'd like to give a shout out to Advil and Ibuprofen for helping me get here. So five years ago when we came here, this was a big ice cave. But now it's a lot warmer this year, so it's just a big waterfall. A little disappointing. This is our campground for anyone wondering. It's very nice. Got some fresh horse turds. Brian is on the hunt. Thought he saw some squirrels up in the trees. Personally, I don't think he can get them. He's not very skilled with the slingshot. Yeah, you heard that. Alright, we're now leaving the Deep Creek Lakes. 
We're leaving a day early so we can do some stuff at Mount Rushmore on the way back. Alright guys, we're at Sheep Bridge again. Pumping water for the last time. This is mile 8 of our 11 mile hike. So this is our last day. We're 3 miles away from our car. We're all super sore. We're gonna crash at a Holiday Inn probably. Alright guys, we're on we're in South Dakota right now on our way home. We're driving down the road to see Mount Rushmore. But unfortunately there's a pretty ominous rainstorm in the distance. We could have been driving back through the Needles Highway and I'm going to. Why? Because it's freaking gorgeous and it's curvy. Just like, like his women. And curvy? We're here! Mount Rushmore! Yay! Gutsan Borglum. Mount Rushmore Theater. He's sleeping. This is our hotel. We have to be mature, Brian. We about to go in that hotel. In this, in this water park, up in here in South Rapids, Dakota. <laughs> Rapid City, South Dakota. Represent! You know what it is! You know what it is! You already know what it is! Hey, yo! Turn up, man! 